hi guys welcome to this tutorial in blender and in this one i'm going to show you a complete process through which you can create your own products in blender i'm going to walk you through step by step from the modeling stage through to the rendering stage i have divided this tutorial in parts so make sure to check out other parts so if you're completely new to blender all you need to do to have access to blender is go to your browser and type in blender type in blender.org and it will land you on the blender uh, landing page okay then you click this button download blender then go to download blender this is the latest version of blender is 3.2 if you want other versions you can click on down there and then you can get other versions of blender okay so let's download this one so you'll be greeted with this page just wait for it for some seconds and then you'll be able to see your download going in whatever downloading app you're using so there's no need for me to download it again so just close this and uh, once it is downloaded just install it just like the way you install any other uh, software on your computer so for this tutorial i'm going to be using blender 3.2 okay um that is because my screencast keys were not working in blender 3.4 but it's the same thing i think there is no much change okay all right, so before I get started, what I'm going to do is I want to maximize my screen there. So I'll, I'll take out this animation timeline over here because I'll, I don't need it. So I will just right click, okay, and uh, I will join the two. So I'll join it down there, okay. So with my screencast keys, you can see whatever I'm pressing, okay. So I'll also make some changes to my preferences. I will go to my navigation. I will take orbit around selection. I'll also add uh, auto depth. Then I go to my add-ons. I will, will activate a few add-ons. I will activate my loop tools. Though I am not going to be using it, but I will activate it. Okay. I will. Um, what else? I, I think that's that's okay, okay for now that's okay for now if i need any add-ons i will be able to bring up i think another useful add-on is uh machine tools yeah i think machine tools machine tools uh do i have machine tools in here yeah i have machine tools yeah. okay so what machine tools does is uh it brings okay so for example if we put this selected and i hover over I have got this pie menu that comes in for me to select what I need to go in. Okay, for beginners, one machine tools does it just replaces this. So if you've got an object here and then you want to edit this object, if you hit tab on your keyboard, okay, you go into the edit mode. So in this edit mode, you can select the points or the edges or the faces by clicking one two for the edges and three for the faces okay so machine tools helps um get rid of this two-step process because i will first need to click on tab then i need to click on a button whether it's one or two or three okay so if machine tools is activated okay if machine tools is activated it's just a one step i just hit tab then i can click whether i want to to just go into edit or maybe i want to edit the face if i want to edit the edge or or the vertex okay if if my muscle memory is good i've memorized everything all i need to do is just do this okay uh go back to my spot is just get up and okay i can just do this fast swings okay just doing these fast swings and I'll be activating stuff. Okay. Okay. I think that is all. Let's now get started with our 
modeling.